in my first video on this channel, you can go check it out right now. I was very nervous. I was very nervous and honestly the video didn't do too well. And it was probably because in my mind, I was telling myself, you know, why should anybody listen to you? There are already many people who talk about the things that you talk about. Why, why would anybody listen to you? That's the kind of voices that I had in my head. And I really think that voice impacted at least the first couple weeks of me making videos. But eventually, that voice became, man, people are missing out if they don't watch. That's the kind of idea I would have in my mind. And when I had that kind of belief, my videos started to do much, much better. I started to put as much value as I could in the videos. And I found that it was just a self-fulfilling prophecy. And I found how important it is to actually believe in what you are selling, right? In my case, it was just a video, but in anything that you are selling, the most important thing is to genuinely believe that it's giving people value. And the reason why I'm even making this video is because when I first got into business, when I started learning about business, when I wanted to think about starting a business venture, everybody that I listened to or everybody that I watched was talking about business is just sales. It's all about sales. It's all about just getting that money. And I realized that, you know, that's wrong because those people won't succeed in the long term. If they're just thinking about their money, they're not thinking about how good is that product? How good? Right? They're not really believing in it. They're just thinking about, oh, well, what's the next sales ta tactic I can do? How much more can I market? Right? It's about genuinely believing in your product. That is what big businesses that are big now, that's what they actually did. Right? The biggest businesses that you can imagine right now, they knew that they were valuable. They believed that they were valuable. They believed that people would be missing out if they didn't come and try to work together. People were missing out. That's the kind of belief that you want to have when you want to sell anything, right? If you're a YouTuber, you're selling things by just being on your video. You're selling things by actually having a face and putting it out. You're selling yourself when you speak to anyone. Everything is about selling. The best way to sell is to first sell yourself on your own product. Make it so good and be so proud of it. Be so confident. Believe that if people don't use it, if people don't have it, they are missing out. That's how you actually sell because it will show your enthusiasm in anything that you do. It will show that you are saying what you believe. It will show that what you're selling is truly valuable if you are genuinely proud of it. It doesn't matter how good of a poker face you can have when you're doing this sales tactic or whatever, right? People can tell. It doesn't matter what kind of poker face that you have when you're doing this sales tactic. Nobody cares. People can tell when you're not proud of what you're selling. When you're not proud of what you're selling, you're done. You must be confident. You must sell yourself first. Show yourself. If I was the customer, if I was a person that wanted to work with this business, would I really want to do it? And you have to work until that answer is yes. You have to work until that answer is yes. You have to be confident in yourself and your product. That is the prerequisite to any selling. Nothing will work until you are genuinely enthusiastic, until you genuinely believe this will help the other person. You must believe it. And confidence in your product first comes from being confident in yourself, from being proud of yourself, from having self-respect. If all throughout your life you believed, I'm not that guy, I'm not that guy, because you either scrolled or you're playing video games or you're doing things that you know you are not supposed to do, you're doing things that make you not proud of yourself. How can you expect that anybody else will trust you? How can you expect that anybody else will believe you? You can't. You have to work for their trust and their respect. You must first develop your personal confidence. That is the prerequisite. That has always been the prerequisite. And the best thing that I would ever recommend to anybody is to start working out. Working out, it changed me, okay? It changed my life. The moment I started working out, I was easily able to speak to anyone. I went from this introverted, skinny, fat kid who could speak to no one, who was always this geek, who was always the butt of the jokes who was the person that nobody wanted to talk to, to the person that people wanted to be around, the person that people wanted to be friends with, the person that people found confident and to be a leader. I got to that place because I started working out. It helped me learn about discipline and overall it helped me gain that musculature, which made me confident in myself. It made me proud to look in the mirror and see an attractive athletic physique. 
that gave me confidence and that gave me the ability to put my face on these videos. It gave me the ability to say, I have my own coaching program because I am so sure that it will change people's lives. It changed my life. That's how I believe in it. That's the whole point, right? I have a coaching program to help people build a physique that they're proud of in the same way that I did with gymnastic rings. I know that it worked. It worked for me. I never went to the gym. I have never gone to a proper gym. I know that gymnastic rings work. I believe in it. I 100% believe in it. I believe in the confidence that I gained. I've sold myself on my own product by making it that good, by knowing that I can guarantee people the same success that I had because I did it for myself. That's the kind of confidence that you need. You need confidence like that. And if you're looking to gain that confidence through working out and building a physique that you're proud of, and you can do it from home, you don't have to waste any time, check out the first thing in the description. That's my coaching program, and I'm there to help you because I know that I can help you. Other ways to be confident in yourself are to really engage in any form of discipline, whether that means taking more risks, whether that means just taking cold showers, whether that means staying committed, doing anything involving discipline will get you confident in yourself and therefore be able to be confident in your product. Again, remember, what you need to do is focus on the product and focus on selling yourself first. The way to convince anyone is to first convince yourself. Again, if you wanna learn exactly how I work out to build this attractive athletic physique that I've built using gymnastic rings from home, check out the first link in the description and I'll help you there. With that, I hope that you got something from this video and I hope that you go out and conquer.